All right, thank you, Janice. Right now, we're looking at new ways you can improve your credit score, including a strategy involving the new Ultra FICO score. Uh, Stuart Welch from the Welch Group joins us to explain this. Hey, good to see you this morning. Good morning. Yeah, so this is something that's actually going to be rolled out next year, right? It is. Okay. It's 2019, so you get a chance to prepare for it. Okay. There, there's like 130 million people that either have a poor FICO score, credit score, or have no score. So this is an opportunity for them to kind of give it a boost. And how do, so what do they do? How do we, how do we get this? So what they're allowing you to do is to kind of voluntarily submit a checking account or savings account okay. for, uh, to be included in the mix. You know, it's a big black box, but now they're saying, we're gonna give you an opportunity. You select the account and, uh, uh, and we're gonna, and it could improve your score maybe 20 points. So if you're on the threshold of going from a poor score to the next level, this might push you over the uh, over the limit. Now, who do you contact to add it? Do you cut one of the three credit bureaus? How does yeah, this happen? Yeah, you would. Okay. So you would uh, you do it through the credit bureaus and uh, and and do a submission. I'm, all the details aren't exactly out there, okay. but 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 what we do know is what a good ultra FICO score looks like. Okay. And that's that checking account. You'd want the balance to be four hundred dollars or more. Okay. So not under that. No negative balances, so don't be uh, yeah, you know, overdrawing. Yeah. Uh, and the other thing is it, it, it helps if it's a checking account where it has activity uh, uh, in bill paying, like paying utilities okay. and things like that, okay. as opposed to an account that's just static. I've got $400 in there, I'm going to improve right. my score. It right. won't help you as much. There are also some, uh, some tried and true ways you can also improve your credit score. Talk about some of those. Yeah, so while we're here, uh, the first, biggest, most important one is to uh, check for accuracy. So mm -hmm. you, you, you get a free credit report. Uh, you, you go to annualcreditreport.com, uh, check for errors. So uh, it's estimated 20% of those reports will have errors in them. So you need to go to each of the credit bureaus. That would be Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax. This next one's kind of Captain Obvious, but you should pay your bills on time. The thing that'll kill you the most is if you don't pay your bills on yeah, time. So yeah. you got to get track on that. And what I tell people is, if you're having problems with that, set it up on, uh, set your paycheck up on auto deposit, set your bills up, your regular bills on auto pay, and make sure that they max, max up, and then take the difference and pay cash for discretionary. All right, you brought up one a lot of people uh, don't know a whole lot about, and that is uh, if you have a certain credit limit, do not maximize that. Stay underneath it. Yeah, so how do you, you're using credit. You have a credit card with a $1,000 limit on it. How much can you use? If you use more than $300, that's 30% of your total credit, it actually begins to hurt your score, so you mm -hmm. want to be 30% or less. Okay. Some good information this morning. Here it is on your screen there, and uh, hopefully everybody improves their credit score because it's so important for so many things other than just applying for loans, as we know, can sometimes uh, affect your job market. It your can, job. everything. Yeah, everything. absolutely. It's really important. All right. Thanks so much, Stuart. Thank you, Mike. All right. It's 812 here. I'm still ahead now. We're joined by the American Cancer Society. We're talking about the Great American Smokeout. That is next when Good Day Alabama continues. You're watching WBRC Fox 6 News, part of the Raycom News Network, Alabama's news source. We're proud to be...